Today, we're going to take a look at creating Favicon. A Favicon is a little icon, comes up in the URL bar, and it also shows up on a tab if you're using tab browsers, but that's not it. When you're browsing your bookmarks, you've got a little thumbnail. It's like a little image so people can browse through their bookmarks much faster. You don't have to read every entry. I like having Favicons because I think they're cool. So this is how we make them. First off, we need to have a .ico file, which is Windows icon file. So it's .ico is the extension. And this place converts them for you because Photoshop doesn't do it automatically and Windows file browser doesn't do it. So this place does it online. And I have it working in action over here. I'm just going to create a new Favicon, uh, you know, just like that. Okay, so we want this to be our site's favicon. So save, and I can close this file, and we are done there. To simply add a favicon, we have to hand code. It's really simple to do. You can use Windows Notepad. And well, first thing I'm going to do is make my code a little bigger. The bit of code for the favicon has to go between the opening head tag, which is right here on line three. And the closing head tag right here. You're looking for your closing and your opening head tags. Now, favicon.ico. So that's the file we need to reference. Look at that. We have a favicon there. We have one here. We'd also have one in the bookmark section. So that's how you create a favicon. Really, really super easy. And um, it's just that one little line of code right here. And that is how you insert a favicon into your website. So I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something from it. Please go check out the website. Thank you for watching.